Hey, what is going on guys? My name is Seth Carr. Welcome back to another video. Today we're going to be looking at some stuff that I bought. Um, so first we'll go over the American Eagle Outfitter shirt. So I got a shirt from here. And I'll just show you that shirt. It says A and E. It's a medium because that's my hand. Nothing on the back, just an A and E shirt. It was. Let's see if it'll focus on that. Nineteen ninety nine. The original price is twenty four ninety five. So we're gonna put that back in the bag. And next from Kicks USA, brand new. Just bought them. Uh, get into it. As you can see by the box, it's Nike Air Force. Nike AF1 Ultra Fly Knit Mid. Size 9. Uh, suggested retail in US dollars is 175. And I like how the box it has when it was established in it's 1982, I think. Yeah. So I are, I didn't try them on, um, but I did redo the box like put the paper on the bottom so there are the shoes they look really white it's the air I got them for $69.99 there's the inside wow these are really nice I like these there's the bottom as you can see it has the icy sole right here it got part of the icy sole right here and then on here is the AF1 bottom it does have the stars all right let's see there is the Nike swoosh as you know it comes back and then here it says Nike Air here's the strap and also what I do like about these like what I like a lot is that this lace tip is fully you could like tell it's a metal it's pretty pretty heavy silver there here's what a, what a front view looks like here let me just move this box down so I can show you guys what a front view looks like there's the other side They're actually really nice. I, I did try them on in the store, um, but I actually, you know, I obviously didn't, like, uh, you know, walk around in them. I just tried them on, stood up, stood up in them. Uh, let me actually take both of the shoes out real quick and show you the, the, wrap, the paper inside because it is actually, honestly, pretty cool, in my opinion. As you can see, it has stars on it, and it has the 1982, like with the gray stars. It's really cool, though. The paper's pretty. It's like literally stars all over it. And then for some reason, I don't know if anyone could tell me in the comments. I don't know if you could see it. All right, there we go. If I put it in, like, you can see there's, like, Chinese symbols there. I'm not so sure what that means. Um, I have heard, like, that there is some, like, there's, like, a Chinese, uh, brand. Not, like, brand, but I mean, like, a Chinese AF1. So maybe that's why. But hopefully you guys like this shoe. I mean, I am pretty in love with them as of right now, and hopefully they fit me forever. But uh, I hope you guys liked this short little review on the Nike AF1 Fly Knits and the American Eagle shirt. Also, I forgot. There's just one more thing I want to show you guys. This is also something that I like. Right there. You see that? Nike AF1. It's weird. It feels weird. Like, it's like a... 
Hmm, how do I describe like a plasticky or like a oh, what do they call it? Some sort of it's like rubber. That's what it is. It's a rubbery material. It is really good shoe though. I give it a ten out of ten for like style and design. Definitely will look good on your feet. I don't know if they're for basketball. I'm most likely they are. But uh, hopefully you guys like this review, and I'll see you in the next video. Leave a dislike, and peace out.